Hey guys, so for today, I got you a smoky pink eyeshadow tutorial. Um, I was asked to do it and today has been a horrible day. It's raining outside and it's really, uh, doesn't even want to let, want, I don't even want to go out. So I was like, what to do? Baby's sleeping. So let's do a tutorial. And this is what I got for you today. It's a pretty simple pink tutorial. It's just one pink, a black, white, and a neutral color. So it's four colors I'm using on my eyes. And I think overall it's a pretty simple um, eyeshadow look. And I hope you guys enjoy it. I hope you guys like it. I'm, I am talking on this video. I am. Because a lot of you suggested that it would be nice to hear a tutorial while I talk and I just music on the background. Um, let me know what you guys think of it. If I should just go back to like playing all music on the background and me just going hella fast. Um, or if you like to prefer videos where I talk. Oh, it's up to you guys. Um, if you want to see any more tutorials, um, just let me know. Leave uh, comments on the bottom. Um, send me a message of tutorials or videos you want me to film. And also follow me on Facebook. Um, I have a Facebook page where you guys can find me just search for simplemente shorty and you'll find me on facebook like the page and let's keep in touch and do all that fun stuff right so enough babbling blah blah blah, blah. um blah, blah, blah. um let's get to the tutorial of this video see you guys soon bye okay guys so let's get started First, uh, as always, I'm going to apply my primer on both of my eyelids, like so, and on the bottom as well. I'm just going to blend it with my ring finger. On the other side as well like that and I'm gonna apply my MAC in Giza with any brush that you want I'm gonna put it on like this right here in the inner corner and mostly throughout the whole eye so we can get the colors to pop more. So just tap it in. Like that. And do the same for the other eye. It's funny how in the camera, the lighting is catching up so much white, but on my mirror, I hardly see any white. It's crazy. Um, I'll put some at the bottom as well, like so. This is it. It doesn't have to be perfect, okay? We're just putting it basically as a base so the color will stand out more. Then I'm going to be using this elf palette I don't recall how many um, colors there is in here but I'll put all the information below so you guys can see and if you guys are interested in getting this thing or you know it's my first time trying it out so let's see how this works out I am going to take a pretty bright pink I'm gonna take the brightest pink 
that's in here, which is that one right there. It's like pretty, pretty um bright. So I'm just gonna be applying it like right from here to like all this, like, and a little bit above the crease, a little bit, not a lot. So I guess you can say I'm doing a review slash tutorial with this palette. Just pat that in there. Grab. Remember always the most important thing that's out there. Start light and start increasing the color as you go. So there we go, like that. And I'm just gonna be leaving it like this. Make sure it's very well. Blend it in and put it together. There we go. So I'm thinking this is gonna be one of the most simplest smoky eyes you can think of. Um, I don't think you can get any more simple than this. So, um, basically white pink and now we're gonna add a little bit of dark color on it so we can make it smoky okay so I'm going to take one of those little dome looking things you know mine has two sides you can see one's bigger than the other um I got this at Walmart so yeah, let's just grab ourselves a black color. And first, I'm gonna use the little one, dip it in there, and apply it on the corner of the eye, like so. Start blending it into the crease, like this. Now don't go all the way over here where the white. Go like halfway of your lid. Like that. And again, like I said, start adding color. Like so. And once you think you have the desired amount, flip it to the other side or get a bigger brush, whatever you have or want. And just circling, make movement, and blend this black out, like this. Just blend it in. Circle motions like that, and back and forth motions will help too. We're just trying to blend in the black and make it less harsh. We don't want a straight up V to be there. Mm -mm, it's not cool. So work with your eye, blend it out. So we got our eyes covered in white, pink, and black. That's your basics. Now, a very light color this one. So I'm just gonna dip my brush in there and just put it on the brow bone. Apply this like so. There we go, like so. Now we are going to apply a highlighter. I'm going to be using my usual L'Oreal 
So, yes. Shake it. Uh, and apply it. There we go. Now, for the inside of our eye, now for the lash line, the water line, um, I'm going to be using Wet n Wild. Come on, get it. Wet and Wild pencil in black. Just gonna apply it inside of my waterline, like so. Like that. A little bit on the top of the waterline. I just close my eye and rub it in. Seems to work fine for me. Mm -hmm. My baby's talking to me on the background. He's over there. We're gonna curl our beautiful lashes. And apply mascara. I'm using Falsies. Voluminous. Oh, Volume Express. The Falsies. Mm hmm. It and apply it like that. Now for the lips, I always like to moisturize my lips before applying anything, any lipstick or anything. You know, so um, I don't have my chapstick around this working area right now. So what I'm gonna use is petroleum jelly. That's right, petroleum jelly. And I'm using my babies. I can't find mine. So I'm just gonna grab a little bit. Just put it on so my lips won't get all chappy. And for color, I'm gonna be using Elves in Nostalgic. Nostalgic? I don't know how you pronounce that. It's like a neutral color. Just gonna pat this baby on here. Ah, what is that? Wrap them lips together. And that's pretty much it. That's how we do a pretty simple smoky pink color. Where you got your white, we got our pink, black, and neutralish color. And some neutral lips as well. There you go, that's how it looks from far away. And that's a close up. That's what it looks like. So, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed my weird talking tutorial. And I will see you guys on my next video.